the funniest moment that I had as far as trash talking. Yeah. Ah, man, I'll bring this one out. And it relates to my 49ers. Um, Great. My dog, Trent Williams, I know him. We talked in the offseason. Uh, you know, we cool. I say, what's up? I don't talk to him like that all the time. But I don't know if he remembers this, but I was a rookie. And I remember Justin Tuck, Jason Pierre-Paul, Mathis Kiwanuka, Big Sean Rogers, all in the room talking about, man, y'all don't know about Big Trent Williams. Big Trent Williams will go out there. He'll put these hands on you. Uh, he'll do this. He'll do that. And Cullen Jenkins, who was on the team at the time, he was a big joke jokester and he was like man it's crazy i'll never forget he said this dude is strong athletic one of the best in my opinion in the game and this was this was early in this career or early this like i said my rookie year he said but he has the most high-pitched voice that you've ever heard and i was like hmm? and at this time you know pirates of the caribbean came out and i'll never forget that they had the big uh pirate on there at the end of it when all the pirates are talking about hey we're gonna go to war we're doing this you have the mean guy over here the biggest guy in the room gets up and he said, so we go to war. <laughs> and you're like, I did not see that voice coming from him. I kid you not. They said that. So we fast forward. We get to the game. We're going in there, pass rushing, doing my thing, talking to Travis like I, like I do. You suck. You can't block me. You can't do this. And Trick has this dark visor on. He looks at me. Hey, rookie. Shut up. You don't know who I am. <laughs> I don't even know who you are. I'm like, <laughs> I look over at the details. I said, dang, he talking to me? What? <laughs> Boy, shut up and put some bass in your voice before you talk to me. <laughs> don't worry about it. I'll get you. And I, obviously, I'm exaggerating. <laughs> Trent, if you see this, please don't. <laughs> hey, we boys, bro. I love you, big bar. Hey, stay strong. But anyways, he goes back and he, uh, he, he said, don't worry about it. We'll see you at this rep. So in my head, I'm like, I'm about to fire him and I'm about to give him everything because you know, uh, <laughs> people weren't thinking that. I'm soaking, I'm 245, 250 as a rookie, soaking wet. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm going to catch him off guard with speed and power. When I made contact with him, when I tell you, think about those old kid commercials and you see stuff go like this, I hit him and I said, mm. <laughs> it felt like a cartoon. My body just did this real quick. He hit me with a stone wall. Ah! Like, I promise you, in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, he put it on me and I said, oh! And, and my legs went numb, but I had my arms, and I'm still arms locked out, but feet dead. <laughs> and he lets me go, and he said, yeah, keep talking. I said, I ain't hurt. I don't care what you say. I run to the sideline, weak legs, noodle legs, and Justin Tuck looks at me. He said, hey, bro, welcome to the league. He said, what are you talking about? <laughs> That might be a concuss, man. Oh, wasn't let him talk to me like that, man. And then with his voice, that's what made it worse. <laughs> well, it was my welcome to the league moment. I was like, hey, don't judge a book by its cover. Obviously, he looks the size, but if you heard his voice, you'll be like, hey, I can take it. But after that, it, it's a wrap. Easy.